Hey everybody, welcome to ROA Off-Road. We're very excited to be bringing to you something that's new to us, which is a lineup exclusively for Jeeps or small tow vehicles. We have several trailers we're very excited to be bringing to you and to show a little bit about these trailers to give you insight for those who are just getting into this space, don't really know where to look. We have some awesome trailers for you, so let's check it out. I am now standing underneath the awning of the Patriot X1. Now, this trailer has some features that are unique to it from the other models, and I'm gonna showcase those, but Patriot in general, one of the main reasons, well, there's lots of reasons, but one of the paramount, just one of the, the factors that everyone loves the Patriot for is their kitchen area. And so right now I'm standing in the kitchen area and you can see how this is a very functional kitchen area where you can have access to your fridge, your utensils, your water, your stove, everything can just, it's all within arm's reach. I don't know that there's anything that exists on the planet that does it better than the Patriot trailers. So this is definitely one of the greatest selling points on a Patriot unit. Now, for the X1, I want to show you why I think it might be the right one for you. I am now standing in front of the changing room and the kids room that have both been set up on the Patriot X1. Now, the Patriot X1, this changing room right here, is standard and it comes in the tent. So as soon as you set up the tent, this changing room is set up right away. And that's something that you don't have on the X3 and that you that it doesn't come already set up on the X1H. And so this one, you're gonna have this changing room set up right away, which makes it easier then to set up the kids room, okay? Now we're gonna go inside and show you how much space you can get inside of the Patriot X1. We're now inside of the X1, and what I wanted to really showcase on this unit is the amount of space that you get with the X1. There's, there's no other Patriot camper that is able to get you this much space so easily. So the X1 is definitely one of their uh, flagship models and one that uh, is absolutely one of their best sellers. So if you are wanting to have space for more people, kids or family, the X1 is one that you should definitely consider. I am standing in front of the X1H from Patriot Campers. So this is one of the trailers in the X range. And what they have done with this trailer is that they have added a couple of features that make it a little bit easier to set up than the X1. Now on the X1H, what you can see here on the roof, it has a hard shell. And so some people really love the idea of having a hard shell on your rooftop tent rather than just canvas. And so for those people, it's very appealing to have the X1H. The other feature that's different and a little unique to the X1H is that it is uh, operated via remote or electric. And so when I come and I hit this button here, I can actually lift my, my rooftop tent up and really I just have to pull it out and then we're set up. So the X1H was designed to be a little bit faster for setup than the X1. And like I said, to have a, uh, to make it a little bit easier. Now, everything else on this trailer is going to be the same as the X1, except for the rooftop tent and also the tent area. So let me show you that real quick. Out here, we have our changing room on the X1H. Now the changing room comes with it, but you have to set it up. Where the X1, it already comes set up on the X1. So the X1H is designed that it can go a little bit faster with the automatic top, 
But if you want to expand it and add the changing room and also a kid's room, it just is gonna take a little bit more effort. So with it, you're getting the hard top and the automatic top that you're not gonna be able to get from the X1, the X1N. So this is what makes the X1H so unique is this flexibility to be able to, you know, just leave it the way it is with the, with the hard top and set it up quickly, but you can also expand it if you want. But X1H, excellent option if you're looking for simplicity, quickness, and unlimited off-road potential. Up in the front on this particular model, you can see that we, here ha we have here the diesel heater and hot water heater. For, uh, that's Wobasto. That's also an option on the X1H, but just wanted you to kind of see what that looks like. The X1 series, the X range, they have the same X Cruise suspension from Cruise Master. The incredible quality design, the off-road capability, it's all there. It's just, just one of their unique models in the X1H with the automatic rooftop, the electric rooftop, that'll just make that a little bit easier for you for setup. So this is the X1H from Patriot Campers. This is the X1N from Patriot. We're really excited to be showing you this unit and why this might be the right unit for you. So first off, I think one of the main reasons people want to get into a Patriot, obviously the quality is exceptional. They are world renowned for the quality that they have in, in, in their builds. The kitchen is without question one of the things that people look forward to and want from a Patriot more than anything. I want to point out, just because some people have had questions, what's coming when it arrives to the United States. And once it gets here to the United States, we're gonna be putting a stove in here, but it's not the Dometic stove that you see in Australia. They cannot send that to the US. And so we have to put in a different stove here in the US. Also, it does not come with a fridge. So that is something you can either buy yourself or we can have supplied for you when you come to pick it up. And then also I'll show you on the other side that it also doesn't come with an inverter, but that's something that we can option out and get installed for you if you would like. Now, what people love about this is the small profile, which is gonna make it so that you have very little limitations when it comes to off-roading. You have the X-Cruise suspension from Cruise Master, which is considered to be without question one of the best suspensions in the world. And this trailer, you can level side to side with your suspension. Now, one of the reasons they decided to go with the X1N is because they wanted to give people the option to have flexibility to mount up here the things that you want, whether that's going to be uh, things like kayaks or extra storage or your rooftop tent that you love. So they wanted to be able to give you the Patriot trailer that you so uh, want and desire, but also to be able to combine it with that love of the James Baroud, uh, which I've had lots of good feedback on or an eye camper or, or whatever, you have that flexibility to put that up here. And so you get the storage, you get the amazing kitchen, the incredible off-road capability, and this trailer dry and without a rooftop tent, you're 1800 pounds. So this is an incredible option for your Jeep. Now, I wanna show you this real quick. One of the other things that they've done, and uh, I had a gentleman come in, he said, man, I wish they had a, a shorter draw bar. Well, one of the advantages of having a longer draw bar is actually your tailgate. That's uh, one of the things that's most frustrating for people is when they drop, when they can't drop their tailgate because it's running into the trailer or running into different components. But with an extended draw bar, it makes it a lot easier to be able to drop your tailgate down without having any problems there. So you can see here that we've also got a space for the barbecue swing out. Um, that's an option. When you get the barbecue swing out, it doesn't come with a barbecue, it's just the swing out. Adding the barbecue is around 200 bucks. And so um, that's just something to be aware of, but I wanted people to know, um, you know what's going on with the, the barbecue swing out there. So for these reasons and many more, 
This is why I love the X1N from Patriot and why you should check it out. I am standing in front of the Patriot X3, one of the most sought after units in the entire world. This unit has won every award imaginable in arguably one of the most competitive atmospheres in the world in Australia. The reason this unit is so sought after is because it is towable by a Jeep, but it has one pretty unique feature. And that is that you can stand up inside of the trailer. I'm inside of the X3 and I am standing up. We have lots of arm room. We have like a couch that you can sit on. You have multiple entrances into the trailer. They have some incredible features on this trailer. The ability to have a table inside, to be able to have access to your fridge or a coffee lift. They have spared no expense in creating what they believe to be and what we believe to be without question, one of the best trailers ever created on the market. Some of the other things that are incredible, the quality, the craftsmanship, the beauty of these trailers is in a class of its own. People all around have known Patriots and followed Patriot for quite some time. So we're very proud to be representing this great brand and this great company here in the USA. And so here, and I wanted to show you some of my other favorite parts about this trailer. This trailer, it does have a kid's bunk. So if, for example, you had a little one sleeping in this area in the trailer and you wanted to be able to slip in and out of the trailer without waking the other person that's asleep, they have a rear entrance for the trailer so that you can get in and out without having to, I mean, even if your partner was sleeping over here, one of you can crawl out this side if you want. You know, if one of you goes to bed earlier, you have two ways to get in and out of the trailer, which is awesome. And then if you're not using it as an entrance or an exit, it's an enormous window. So if you're parked by a beach or some incredible mountain range, you can use this as an open window into the outdoors, which is amazing. Now over here, we have our amazing PCOR awning set up. Because this is the biggest unit that they have, one of the things that they've actually done, they've increased the space for your fridge. So you can actually get a bigger fridge in the X3 than you can in any of the other models. Now the other thing that's pretty cool about the X3 is, th is that they've actually extended your counter space in this kitchen area right here. So this kitchen area in the X3 for owners around the world is one of the most important things for them. They love the suspension, they love the way it looks, they love the way it feels, but one of the biggest reasons people are buying Patriot trailers is because of this right here. They do this better than anyone else. And this setup here where you have everything accessible between your stove having all of this counter space, an incredible fridge and sink, all in a, in a continuous motion, makes this the prized possession for campers around the world. For these reasons and many more, this is one of the most sought after trailers for people with small tow vehicles, you know, like Jeeps or Forerunners or Tacomas, uh, because it's, it's, it's light, you can stand up in it, it's just got a lot of features that people want. So this is the X3 from Patriot. You're definitely gonna wanna check this one out. This is the Taxa Tiger Moth Overland Edition 2022. And here are some reasons why I want this to be in our lineup today. A couple of reasons I love this trailer. Number one, it's weight. The trailer's 1400 pounds, so this is easily gonna be towable by your Jeep. The other is the construction. With an all aluminum and steel construction, this is a very sturdy, sturdy trailer. It's got independent suspension. Here you can see your propane mount, but check this out. We have our awning set up. And this is called the Mosquito Room, which comes with the soft goods package. 
So I can have with my trailer this really nice area that I can zip up and, and keep all the bugs out. I can cook in here. Um, I can set out, you know, my, my sink area right here. And then I've got a space that I can sit inside of the trailer, fully extended. This trailer is awesome. And the nice thing is if I'm taking this out on a trip, if I get to a spot, all I've got to do is open up the door, get in, and I can pull this bed out and I'm ready to sleep. So there's almost no setup. You've got to love the bat wing door right here that serves basically like a second awning. You can see all the shade that we have right here in the middle of the day from our awning here and this bat wing that's opened up and there's a screen that can go right here to get you um, additional protection from the bugs. But the trailer also comes with an articulating hitch is what you're gonna be looking for on most off-road vehicles. So this is a quick look over and look through the Taxa Tiger Moth Overland. So this is a trailer that we can recommend to anyone with 3,500 pounds of tow capacity. So definitely this is something you're gonna to wanna to look into the Taxa Tiger Moth Overland. All right, I am now here with a 2022 Taxa Cricket. And I have had several Jeep owners walk away with one of these for lots of reasons. One of which is because this unit weighs only 1800 pounds. Now, if you go up to the Overland model, you're gonna be um, in the 2000s, but this is a standard model, which again is 1800 pounds dry which is incredible. Now, one of the things that I get from people that have Jeeps, a common request is I want something I can tow with my Jeep that I can stand up in. And the truth is there's just not many things in that category that are something that I feel I can recommend to somebody who's going to be doing off-roading and, you know, doing a lot of washboard roads. Now, the one of the reasons I am okay with recommending a Taxa for off-roading is because of the construction. The walls are aluminum. It's got a steel frame and it's got aluminum inside, an aluminum skeleton inside that uh, reinforces the trailer. You know, the wood that they use inside is, is Baltic birch and the storage is milk crates. And it's like, if we go through this, what's gonna fall apart? You know, the, the, the trailer is gonna do really well, you know, off-roading. And, and the, the thing I tell people is, if I was to take this on a washboard road for 50 miles, how would your trailer do? And if your trailer can handle 50, 50 miles of intense, washboard roads, that's a great trailer. And this trailer can 100% handle that. So this is why we carry the Taxa lineup. They have an excellent build quality. They're not as off-road capable with regards to clearance, but they are certainly, for most people, going to be able to get them. And I've done a plenty of off-roading in both the Mantis and the Cricket. They go lots of places, more places than most people will go anyways. Here is what a lot of people are looking for is this ability to stand up. You can tow it with a Jeep and you can stand up inside of the unit. This particular unit with the soft goods package has a toilet that it comes with and a shower enclosure that you can set up outside um, that you can use for your shower and for using the restroom or you can close all the doors and use a restroom in here. So it's, it's very sought after for owners to have something that they feel like they're not cramped in, but have a lot of space. So it's got excellent um, space and the weight is very light, which those two don't usually go together. Lots of space and light. Um, and so it breaks a lot of rules. And for that reason, we love the Taxa models. Now, the other thing uh, in the Mantis and in the Cricket that we absolutely love, um, obviously this dinette is awesome, but this back door that allows you to, if you get to a beautiful location, you back up to a beach or you back up, you're up in the mountains and you back in your trailer, you know, overlooking this incredible scenery, 
you can be camping, but don't feel like you're shutting out the world. You feel like when you open a door like that, that you're bringing the world in. And so this trailer breaks a lot of rules. And because of that, we love it. It tows beautifully. This is without question, something you won't want to pass by if you have a Jeep and you're looking for lots of space and very, very light to tow. All right, I am standing in front of the XOC from Vorshear. Now, a couple of things that I love about this unit. Uh, number one is going to be clearance. They have prioritized having virtually unlimited clearance. It's just not something you're gonna have to worry about. You can see we've got some BF Goodrich KO2s on 35s here on this baby. It's got independent suspension. And another thing that I really like about this unit, which is I've come to find requested more and more, is actually air conditioning. And not all air conditioning units are the same or, or as capable. This air conditioning unit that comes in the XOC is actually quite strong and very capable. It's definitely gonna be able to cool you off at high, high temperatures and not all AC units are able to do that. At a high, high temperature, some AC units, they're just not able to really get you the kind of comfort that you, that you want. This one is able to do that. So inside of the cabin, I have both an AC unit and a heater, which is really awesome. Going around, we have our outdoor kitchen right here. And one of the other unique features is this awesome a uh, table that you can get with the XOC and you have access obviously to all of your kitchen area right here with plenty of storage in the back. You've got mounts here for shovels, axes, uh, more mole boards. You have jerry can holders right here. The rack is capable of any rooftop tent that you can imagine, even up to king size but you can also carry toys up there for kayaks. It does have a receiver on the back for bikes, but this unit is very versatile. Also something else that's been brought up is they actually like the, the smell and the look of the wood finish on the inside. And so that's been something, you know, all of the trailers that we carry are very high quality. And so one of the decision-making factors that you make is gonna be on how it looks and how it feels. The quality is gonna remain consistent, but do you like the wood finish? Do you like a metal finish? You know, what is it that, you, that you're looking for? And that's, you know, these are some of the things that would lead you to buy an XOC are, are the look, the layout, and the quality is there. It's just looking to see which is gonna be the best fit for you. Another thing I'll show you real quick, I do love, the thoughtful design from Vorshear, they added these bars up in the front to pick up and move your trailer. I mean, I could go and point out all of our other trailers, but nobody else has anything like this. And I love that thoughtful, thoughtful part. Then you have more storage up in the front. Everybody wants storage and you have two awesome, awesome places for storage here in the XOC, in addition to what they have in the back. And so those are some of the reasons I love the XOC and why this might be a great trailer for you. We have the new XCT from Vorshear. And today we're gonna go through real quickly, talk about this awesome new uh, model that they're coming out with, talk about some of the differences and why this might be the right trailer for you. So first of all, what they've done with this unit is they've completely redesigned the, uh, the construction of the trailer to be able to get the cost down but it's also, they've made a lot of great changes that are benefits for you as an owner. So the biggest change is gonna be this fiberglass nose cone that they have here that's in the front and extends all the way to the rear. So there's no seams from the front all the way to the back. It's all, it's all one piece here with this fiberglass piece and it looks really, really clean. So I was talking with um, Steve, who's the owner, and he was just saying that that alone has reduced their cost significantly because of the amount of time that they had to spend on the XOC with the construction. Just that one change made a huge, huge difference. Um, inside uh, has a little bit more space. They had 
um, a few more components on the XOC that aren't here on this one. So it's a little bit more simplistic. Now this, this is the prototype. So it, for the cabinetry, they're gonna be um, making some changes to the cabinetry, the layout, the size of everything. So this is not the final model, but it's gonna give you a really good idea of, of what you can expect visually for the trailer to look like and what the components will be. So this is uh, also another really cool change. Um, on the XOC, the back door opens all the way up, and so you can't do a 270 degree awning. But with the new XCT, the way that they've designed it, the um, awning, you actually can go 270 degrees, and I'll show you the back part, which I actually really, really like. So we'll come here. So this is the new rear galley on the XCT. So again, there will be some changes, but this is very, very cool. So one big difference from the XOC is the kitchen is actually quite a bit lower for us short people. It's a nice thing. <laughs> uh, they're gonna be making some uh, changes to the cabinetry here, but this fridge will be here. They're gonna add a little bit more storage, but I also really like this table that they've put here that you can set up, that you can have a really nice, large table, this counter space here for your, for your cooking. So um, these are really, you know, the differences are the materials that they've used. So there's no wood in this construction. Um, they're using composite and, and metal for this construction, and they've added a lot more insulation in this trailer than they have in the past. So that, is a quick rundown of the XCT. We're very excited. And this one, you can expect to see it um, in the 40s range, you know, depending on how you build it. Uh, but it's around 40,000. But uh, yeah, this is the XCT from Vorscher. Very, very excited. And, and again, on the weight, we're about 2,000 pounds. So this is going to work for your Jeeps, for your Broncos and your low towing capacity tow vehicles. So um, definitely one you're gonna wanna add to your list when you're trying to figure out which off-road trailer is right for you. Hey everybody, I hope you guys enjoyed these awesome, awesome trailers. We hope that we can continue to bring you the newest, most innovative and capable off-road trailers in the world. Please don't forget to like and subscribe so you can see all of the new content we have coming in the future and we look forward to seeing you guys on the trails.